On Friday night, Bozeman football wrote their names into history as the first team to win a state title in the new Van Winkle Stadium right behind me. They took down the one seed out of the West Glacier 35 to 27, capping off an undefeated season with their first state title since 2019. I never felt like we were going to lose a game. I, I had just tons of trust and from playing around those guys for so long, I, I felt super confident in, in the guys to get it done every week. Um, I think we knew before the season it was going to be special. I think that uh, we kind of knew that we were going to be better, be good this year, and I think we all just kind of realized that we, if we put in the work, we, we can make this really special. The team fell in the state championship last year at Capitol, and they used it as motivation for this season, refusing to lose another game since the final buzzer rang on the 2022 season in Helena. Um, you win it for everybody that's been in the brotherhood from, you know, from the beginning till now, you know. Um, it's, it's everybody. You know, we really don't talk state championships at all. We, we talk about getting better one day at a time. We talk about doing, you know, upholding the standard and, and playing hog football. The brotherhood for Bozeman is front and center, and the coaches, their guidance and mentorship will stick with these athletes long after this season. From the minute I came my freshman year, I looked up to the coaches. Um, Coach Mobley, Coach Weshy, and Coach Boyle have been They've been like family to me. They've taught me everything. They put me under their wing, and they're just unbelievable coaches. And also, I can call them my best friends. I know that throughout life, I'll be able to turn to them if I ever need to. For Harrison, this was his first season starting at quarterback at the varsity level. But with this high level of play from the jump, you wouldn't be able to tell that. He capped off a stellar season with five total touchdowns in the team's state title game. Just normal, just fun for me, to be honest. Like, it makes my life so easy when Kellen plays like that. So that was really fun. I think I just relied on my teammates. They did a great job and they helped me get, like, play well. And I think I always had utmost trust in my teammates, and that's the thing why I was really comfortable playing. Ash had two touchdowns in the game clinching interception. After the game, Weshi described the tight end and linebacker as the heart and soul of the team this year. To leave his own stamp on the program is something he'll always cherish. You no, know, it's one thing to you know, do it because, to just to do it, but the fact that my brothers have both been through here and set such a great mark in the program, I mean, it's just very thankful that I have them to look up to, and um, I'm just happy I could, you know, get one too, just like my brother. Coach Weshi did tell me he's going to try and take some more time, this state title, to really enjoy it before he starts looking ahead to next season, like every great coach tends to do. Reporting in Bozeman, Grace Lawrence, MTN Sports.